Hi y'all, this is Brittany with Brittany Creations. I have a 12 by 12 mixed media canvas to share with you. Um, so here it is. Ta-da! So let me put it here. It's 12 by 12 and it's black and yellow themed. So the reason I picked this color scheme, I was looking for something different to do and I was going through, I have on Pinterest, um, if you follow my Pinterest, I have like a thing called colors or inspirational photos. Um, and in the colors, I like put things where it inspires me. And there was a black fish and the outline of its body it had a yellow line going all the way around its body. I believe it was a beta fish and it was beautiful. So that's why I got my inspiration to go with black and yellow. Um, and the fish also helped me with this because it's very oriental. Um, because I actually have a fan in the background here. Um, it's a wooden fan. I forget where I got it from. But, um, so that's what the background is. And I sprayed it with yellow. I painted yellow. And then I sprayed yellow. And then I painted black here. And I did like streaks coming out. Like a burst almost. And I painted these here. And then I did like a shadow behind here. Because I didn't like how it looked with out it like you didn't I didn't like the contrast so I had to do something like a shadow to make the stand the fan stand out and I did black splatter all over and then I did this stamping with this Prima stamp like the checkerboard and I did that going all the way around the side too and then so what I did and then I have this black beautiful beaded applique which I added, which was like the beginning of like everything else. And I have this big white flower here, which is gorgeous. And I just started layering different flowers. So um, these three here and these, these are Prima flowers. I love these flowers and I only have one flower left because I used them here. So I don't have that much yellow or black. So this was really hard for me. Um, I have a white and yellow trellis rose from Wilder Craft. Um, I have these Prima leather fabric glitter um, flowers. Oops, I'm not even frame here. And I have another one up here in a darker tone. And then I have, this is a black recollections flower. I have a black spare parts flower. And then this is a Prima flower here. Right here, this yellow one with the Oh my god, the yellow one with the bling. Sorry guys. And then these bright yellow ones I added in. And this is the wild craft flower, just white. And then, oh, this is a prima flower. And I added these in because I have these branches, kind of like a cherry blossom tree. Um, so that's why I use these glass flowers here. I tucked one in here. I have a white one. I'm not even showing you. Sorry guys. I'm like, maybe if I zoomed out. And then I have another black one under here. And, okay, so over here I have another one of these white flowers tucked under here just for layering. And I have another yellow Prima flower, and then another one here, and then another one of those fabric black ones, and then some black roses, and then another one of these flat yellow flowers. And you can see I did the yellow and the black splatter all over everything. And then here I have this really pretty beaded piece that I just added that dangles down. And then I have a um, uh, Kaiser Craft wooden dress form in black just tied in there. And then I have the these branches, which are these beautiful yellow flowers I layered kind of to mimic a cherry blossom tree. So I really, really love how this came out. Let me know what you guys think, and I will talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.